Alpha 007, turn right, heading 185, reduce speed 182 or not. 185 on the heading 180 on the speed Alpha 007. Speed at 124, reduce speed 160 or not to 40 or me. So, here we are at a very bright, I should probably put my sunglasses on actually now, because we actually have sun, let me just sort this out, there we go, a very bright Liverpool, um, in this beast, I don't know whether you can actually see this aircraft, there is Mr. Owen, <laughs> say hi, hello, we'll be doing more flying today. This is uh, Roma Aviators Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey, which is uh, a Warrior 3, which is it's actually not the one that I fly. I fly that one over there. You can see it, just the blue one, and then there's another one as well somewhere, but it's currently out and about. Uh, this is a, I don't know, actually in terms of power to weight and everything, I don't know if it's faster than mine or slower than mine, but probably... Okay, so it's definitely a bit faster. Um, but yeah, we're here at Liverpool. It's a relatively reasonable afternoon. And we are going to head down to uh, a place in Wales called Carnarvon. Or Carnarfon. Probably a Welsh way of saying it as well, but I don't attempt to know that pronunciation. Uh, so we've already done all the pre-flight checks. Uh, as far as the A-Chex aircraft is in good shape. And... Um, now it's just a case of plugging everything in, setting all the GoPros up inside, and then uh, we'll go book out. I phone the tower and tell them that we're uh, going to be disappearing very soon. And uh, yeah, that's really about it. So welcome to the first IRL flight. Let's hope it's a good one. Flaps, one, two, three. Good. Asymmetry. Yeah. There's no asymmetry then. Oh. Happy. <laughs> That'd be interesting, wouldn't it? Uh, right, circuit breakers, flush, no white bands, all in. Alternate static source, just going to verify he's in the off position. It's off, open it, back closed. Engine controls, I've got full free correct movement, same with the car beat. The mags are off. The circuit breakers again, just double check it all in. The master switch is going to come on. External light deep and nav lights. The fuel is on the lowest tank. Mixture is now full rich. The fuel pump can come on. Now we have a electric starter in this. Uh, oh, how fancy. Electric primer. So we're going to give it, it's a warm day, so probably about what? Four, five. One thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, five, one thousand. That's happy. Set the throttle for start. Clear prop. Clear on the left apart from Steve, clear on the right, clear behind. Steve is at the prop arc. Covering the brakes. <laughs> 12, 12 p.m. set. Touch the pressure on the green, start a warning light is out. <laughs> I left that. <laughs> <laughs> Suction's within limits, and we're just going to check with the landing light. Jumps 13, 14, that's fine. Fuel pump, full burst, max, check for dead. Might have an issue with the left mag when we do the power checks, but we'll sort it. Last. Yep. Okay, cool. Fuel pump off. Right, okay. Oh, this is a, a really new airplane compared to the, the Cherokee. 
Uh, you've been flying. Yeah, no, I only have a handbrake. I don't even have toe brakes, dude. Isn't your trim on the, uh, on the roof? on the ceiling, the brakes are not brakes. It basically is a kite. <laughs> yeah, to be fair, I, I learned flying trauma hawks, so I had a similar experience, but not with the dodgy trim. It just looked like I was tossing off my instructor. Pretty sure that on a daily basis, the trim changes direction. Yeah, it does. Generally with the tomahawk though, I found that for straight and level, yeah. four swipes nose down works just fine. But to be honest, I change the trim depending on the weight I've got on board. I know everyone says set it neutral, but what is the point when you've got so much weight up front? Alright, it's less of a fat shaming. No, 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 no. I mean, I told my family flying and had people in the back, so I'd want <laughs> a little bit less of a before the neutral. Oh, f somebody take the shovel off me. <laughs> <laughs> Right, radio's now in intercom, so I've got 129555. You have? Uh, 126355 set. 5050, I'm expecting for the squawk, um, and I've got the ATIS on COM2 ready to get. The transponder is on standby, the heading indicator by a check, so I have got 080 degrees, which the gyro has. That's, that's the first time I've ever had that. A line. Same, actually. <laughs> navigator and transponder, that's all set. Are you going to use any navigators today? No VOR tracking, it's purely VFR. Parking brake is set to the fuel selector. I am going to change now to the right tank, watching the fuel pressure. Pressure's constant, so we know the mechanical pump is working. I'm going to check them not. This is an interesting thing. You say you just changed the fuel pump, pump across. Uh, sorry, the fuel selector across. I did. Why didn't you put the fuel pump on first? Because. With the. So, when you're checking, um, when you're changing the fuel tank over, yeah. you want to do it without the fuel pump purely because you have checked that the mechanical pump within the engine is working. If you turn that electric fuel pump on, there's no guarantee that the mechanical pump is working. So if you have that fail in flight, and you then have to start changing tanks with the mechanical pump, and you don't know if it's working or not, you're So that's why uh, whenever you change it, okay, I land. <laughs> so the first check, you never put the fuel pump on for it. Everything else after that you do. Cool. Uh, okay. So, yeah, I was up to fuel selector, I've just changed that to the right tank. Temperatures and pressures, green, green, the temperature has to come up, but with this day I'm wearing a chile and I'm sweating me d off. Uh, not gonna blow any little kids over, there's no expensive aeroplanes behind us, we're gonna wreck, so... Like, expensive fuel truck. Ah, uh, well, what's it gonna do, blow up? Uh, <laughs> covering the brakes, 2000 RPM. <gasps> Bang, no ADSB position. <laughs> it's all on the apron. Copy. Good drop. Back to off. Which one's there? Uh, I was expecting the left because it rumbled a bit when I did the dead check before. Are you right? Sorry. Right. Yeah, right. That's fine. Um, okay. Are you or you know. Hey, better to be cautious. Absolutely. Okay, both drops are within their own limits, and within the two, they are both within limits. Um, we've got green, green. That's good carbon monoxide indicator isn't that isn't showing any issues, so I'm just gonna pass out. What a shame. Hello, I think we have got the air ambulance coming in because there's a marshal. Yes, there is, and there's also an ambulance uh, behind that building over there. Oh, that's nice. Right. Okay, so just need to wait literally two minutes for that to come up. So the trimmer oh, it's just here. Oh, it's just worse than being down there, up there. <laughs> well, from the outside, this looks dodgy. <laughs> yeah, and probably actually on camera, it looks dodgy as well. <laughs> hey, these buy me a drink first. <laughs> um, the is loose. The primer, um, it's a electric primer, so that is closed. Oh. The mixture is full rich. Yep. The uh, fuel selector is on the right tank. I have confirmed that the fuel pressure is still stable. Um, the fuel pump, now oh, come on, the car peat is off. The en engine instruments, green, green, that's coming up. Yeah. Heading indicator, 08, 08. Altimeter, I'm going to get the ATIS and I'll sort that out in a second. Radios and navigates. Not using, but we've got ground. Yeah. I'm secure, you're secure. Oh, I am more than secure. I'm quite insecure. Uh, Actually. Right, flying controls, I have full free and correct movement. Excellent. Right, let's get my handy dandy. Oh, easy, yeah. Oh. Cloud, temperature plus one four, new pipe plus eight, QNH one zero one one, threshold QSE one zero zero nine, apron entrance uniform is closed, ground movement control is open, departing aircraft to call ground on one two one decimal nine oh five, acknowledge receipt of information, Lima and advise aircraft type on first contact, Liverpool information, Lima time one one zero.
Um, so we'll, uh, we'll, we'll crack on. Little Power, very good afternoon. Golf, Whiskey, Alpha, Romeo, Whiskey, K28 at Kilo with Lima, QH, Hop, Zero, Warbuck, Close to Park, Clearance and Taxi. Golf, Whiskey, Alpha, Romeo, Whiskey, Little Ground, hold on Kilo, after departure, lead to control zone, fire your car, bay, up above altitude, 1,500 feet, BFR, Hawk 5050. Okay, well, while we're holding here, big hello to everybody. We haven't really had a chance. Golf Romeo Whiskey, taxi on point Echo, 1809, QNH1011. Echo 09, QNH1011, Golf Romeo Whiskey. Did you that well? Yeah, just a bit. So, we, uh... Actually, can't. Oh yeah, the last time we, I spoke to you, I said we were going to Carnarvon. We're no longer going to Carnarvon. Oh, November Alpha, hold at Echo, contact power, 26, that's one, three, five, five. Weather. Echo, not so great. Power, one, three, six, we are heading to the north, so we're off to Blackpool. The weather down at Carnarvon's always quite changeable. No problem, Alpha, Yankee, just running on the hot track. Alpha, Yankee, little ground, give way to the Cherokee, taxiing from right to left on taxi, Alpha, then taxi. So that guy's coming off. Yeah, it's the top hawk. I just see his tail there off. Yeah, so I might just expedite a little bit so I don't infuriate him too much.
very south on air, Golf Whiskey Alpha, Romeo Whiskey, basic service and mass penetration. Golf Whiskey Alpha, Romeo Whiskey, what now? Good afternoon, half past details. Golf Whiskey Alpha, Romeo Whiskey, TA28, Liverpool, local with touch and go, Blackpool. Currently, altitude 1400 feet, Liverpool QH 1011, 4 nautical miles east of Woodbay, Lad Hills. Less than a basic service, max penetration through your zone, uh, up towards Lancaster, and then we'd like to head towards Blackpool, touch and go. Golf of Whiskey, Roger, basic service, uh, transit parts, QH 1011. That's transit approved, QH 1011, Golf of Whiskey. Okay, three, contact Scottish star 12, decimal 055. Right. Okay, so expecting a score. Right, you're a bit further down the line? Yeah, you'd think. Um, there's nothing to affect at the moment. Yeah. So I'm just going to turn on route towards war. Easy. Easy peasy. Okay, then here's a question. If you could give any advice to somebody going from swimming. So the real world, what would it be? How much of a transition is it? For the love of God, do not go into it thinking you know everything. Gosh, I'll tell the uh, aerobatic aircraft back to the uh, west of you, two and a half miles, and they're getting three sides of food. Like? <laughs> the symbol definitely teach you some really valuable pieces of information. But if you go into it thinking you know it all, and what you'll tend to do is not digest the bits that you don't know. And then you will end up killing somebody or yourself. Yeah. And I actually, I should probably like to start a blog or something about this, but once upon a time, I was, uh, I was really scared about starting to fly again. Because I had so much sim experience, I was bothered that something like that would happen. And so when I came to the flying school, I turned around to them and I said, look, you know I've flown before, but you just assume I haven't. Yeah, that's, that's, that's like the best way to do it. idiot. And, you know, it's worked perfectly. Because, yeah, you know, after a lesson now, an instructor's saying to me, yeah, you really know your I'm like, well, thank you, I appreciate that. But I also, like, you're, you're teaching me new things all the time. Yeah. And here, yeah, it's water now, then. Huh? Call for me, let's keep water now, man. Blackpool Approach, Golf Whiskey Alpha, Romeo Whiskey inbound. Golf Whiskey Alqf, Alpha, Romeo Whiskey, Blackpool Approach, QNH, QFB 1010, support 0450. Remain outside the 80s, and I'll call you in as soon as I can. 0450, QNH, uh, QFB 1010, on the main outside, Golf Romeo Whiskey. Yeah, just, uh, there you go. Ah, uh, okay. Golf India Bravo, uh, line up and wait, one way, one zero. Line up, wait, one zero, Golf India Bravo. And Golf India Bravo, left turn up, one way, one zero, clear for takeoff, surface wind zero nine, zero degrees, one eight knots. Clear for takeoff and left turn up, Golf India Bravo. Clear for the traffic. Hit the wrong day to wear a sweater and a shiba. Golf Post. Romeo, Coach Golf Whiskey Alpha, Romeo, Whiskey Ford call sign, similar call sign on frequency. And uh, continue inbound report west of the tall tower. Expect a left base join those of his circuit traffic and already active. Full call sign, uh, expect left base for runway 10 and route west of the tall tower. Golf Whiskey Alpha, Romeo Whiskey. Golf Whiskey Alpha, Romeo Whiskey, correct. We may have to uh, hold you off at the tall tower, but uh, we'll get you in as soon as we can. Not an issue, Golf Romeo Whiskey. Golf Whiskey Alpha, Romeo Whiskey. Golf Charlie in the Romeo Whiskey. That's going to be a problem. <laughs> Today. Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey, turn left base of the Immortal Farmer. Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey, turn left base of the Immortal Farmer. 
Alpha Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey report final number two to a PA28 short final. Full final number two, uh, negative contact with the traffic, uh, but we'll look at Golf Romeo Whiskey. Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey, it's very short final. Roger the Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey. Golf Charlie India Romeo Whiskey, you'll be number two now following a PA28 joining left base from the north. That's got to be number two, Golf Charlie India Romeo Whiskey. Right, let's start bringing the power back then. Still put power landing light on. Golf Oscar Juliet, vacate left delta, bravo, back to high G. Bravo, high G, Golf Oscar Juliet. I'm not touching you, I promise, I'm just trimming. All good, dude. So we have limitation, operation, indication one, indication two. Yeah. Limited eight uh, alpha for Blackburn, fifteen hundred RPM trimmed. Any more two eight alpha or a final? Apart from me, I'm flying a spatial circuit here. Yeah, I was going to say. Well, the only reason that I did that was because I didn't know where the other traffic was, so I thought if I really need to extend, then I didn't want to be up his chuff, basically. Golf Romeo whiskey, Golf Charlie, Romeo whiskey, down to one. Snap. Oh, Charlie India Romeo Whiskey uh, report final number two following the PA28 wide left base. Report final wide right left base. Don't worry, we'll leave it out for three ways to touch it. Not that other option really. Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey turning final. Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey runway 10, clear touch and go surface wind 080 degrees at 1600. Only zero one zero clear touch and go golf for Romeo whiskey whiskey out for Romeo whiskey. I go for Romeo Lee, my whole position I'll get you out as soon as I can. Well Billy, I'll be out of the way. Right, we're high, which is fine. Yeah, make a bit of extra energy. To bring the power back. The only reason I brought us in a little bit higher is because I don't like the idea of being so low over the sea single engine. But that's purely it. All good. I, well, not a jet. The car be is cold, the runway is clear, approach is somewhat stable. Yep, power set, permission is given. Heli Med 08 Alpha ready for departure. Heli Med 08 Alpha, taxi heli point, correction, heli point north to surface wind 080 degrees 16 knots. Taxi heli north, Heli Med 08 Alpha. Heli Med 08 Alpha, traffic uh, short final for a touch and go runway 10, further traffic late downwind left base. Hey, Tom. Anima 08, Alpha remain north of the runway 10 and the climb out. Uh, clear for takeoff at surface wind 080 degrees at 16 knots. Really north of the main and climb out 10, clear takeoff, Helimed 08, Alpha. Alpha, Helimed 08, Alpha, Helimed 08, Alpha, Helimed 08, Alpha. Very high indicated speed because the headwind is so stonking. But it's better to have more energy than less. Indeed. Got all the runway in the world. Right. Charlie, India Romeo, yeah. whiskey heli med traffic will be crossing left to right and reaching southbound ahead of you. Uh, Roger, got to Charlie, India Romeo. Heli med 08, off your visual with the PA28 on the runway. Negative, heli med 08. Oh, you greasy. Right <laughs> <laughs> oh, you went somewhere. Take off. Looking. Visual. Thank you. Uh, behind the uh, PA28 on the runway, cross runway uh, 10, uh, report south off the runway. I will go for the mid-8 alpha, might not be as well as I'm going to be able to. Sorry, Alpha, Roger, that's further traffic, just coming on to short final. Go on, Charlie, India, Romeo, let's get short final. Anyway, sorry, Alpha, cross the chat, uh, cancel the crossing clearance and hold position. Whoosh! For the mid-8 alpha, are you talking about? Anyway, sorry, Alpha, cancel the crossing clearance, remain north, runway 10. Remaining north at all times, for the mid-8 alpha. Like that. 
Port Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey Route to St. Anne's Pier to Southport Pier, not above altitude 1,500 feet on the QNH 1012 and squawk now 3650. 3650, St. Anne's Pier, not above altitude 1,500 feet BMR, Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey. Golf Sierra Tango, beam, uh, Tall Tower, mate. Sierra Tango, join left base, runway 10, number 2, following a Cessna 150 on final. Uh, uh, left base for runway 10, visual with the traffic, Golf Sierra Tango, number 2. Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey, contact Walton Radar 129, decimal 530. Contact Walton 129, decimal 530, thanks for your help today, good afternoon. Golf Charlie. Walton Radar Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey. Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey, Walton, hello, transit about southbound QNH 1012. QNH 1012, contact about transit about Golf Whiskey Alpha Romeo Whiskey. Golf Romeo Whiskey's basic service. Basic, go for any whiskey. Tell you what, man, it's been a busy one. Yeah, but how fun is it, dude? It's so good. Yeah. Wouldn't, wouldn't want it any other way. So amazing. Alright. Okay. 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 Okay.